Marcus! What? What are you doing? Getting ready. I'm getting pumped. I'm getting jacked. I'm getting drunk. I'm getting ready. I'm getting pumped. I'm getting jacked. Oh, I'm getting for, drunk. For what? For Elite. EWA Elite when, Tournament. When's that? It's this Saturday, October 16th, 2010. Get the hell out of here! Yeah, they sent you a Facebook event. I don't check my Facebook! Well, you should, because then we wouldn't be having this conversation right now. <sighs> so what are we gonna do? I mean, I'll tell you what we're gonna do. Okay. Boss. We're, we're gonna... We're gonna show up. Okay. We're gonna take over. Let's go we're gonna there. dominate. Yes. We're gonna seek. Okay. We're gonna destroy. Yes. We're gonna divide. Yeah. We're gonna conquer. Okay. We're gonna rise. Yes. They're gonna fall. Fall. They're going down. Down. We're going up. Yes. We are not going to back down. No, no, no. Just like that Eminem song. What song? I'm, I won't back down. Oh, okay. Yeah, I like that song. Actually, yeah, yeah, it's got pink on it. Yeah, she's really she, hot. She's a real classy lady. Yes, yeah, she is. But listen, listen. Okay. We gotta get serious, okay? okay. Yeah, serious. Serious time. Okay. Right, are you ready? Yeah. Are you ready, ready for the serious yeah, show? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. yeah. Okay. Lemon yeah. face. <laughs> Lion face. <laughs> Patrick Wade Wilson. You want to say you looked up to me? You want to say that I'm the inspiration for you to get into the ring, to get onto the base, to perform in front of your peers, for the admiration of your peers, for the, for for the for the entertainment of others. I'm the reason you decided to wrestle, and not only that, it was my match at WrestleFest 9, me and Jay Two-Step against Tommy Flambeau and B-Cubed. Let me, let me let you in on a little secret there, PWW. That was a mailed-in performance. 9-11, September 11th, EWA, six-man tag. You gave it your all, and you proved you're nowhere near me, boy. You are nowhere near Cintafonte. And you know it's serious because I'm giving you Cintafonte voice right now. Listen. First round, me versus you, one on one. You want it. You can be upset. You can be broken hearted. You can cry. You can go listen to Hawthorne Heights. Ohio is for lovers. You can listen to something else that's emo. I don't listen to it, so I don't know the bands. You can be upset. You can be as, as shattered as you want that your idol, your hero, betrayed you, and splashed you, and made you bleed. Spit up blood. Thanks for telling me that, idiot. Cause now you painted a big old target on that big old belly. Do it again. <laughs> big old belly. <laughs> and I'm coming for you, man. I'm gonna take you out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and say I'm gonna take you out in record time. Because I got a lot to do that day to become the third new era champion. And I gotta kill EWA. It's, it's quite the process. Patrick Wade Wilson, you can call me an old folk. You can say I came out of the retirement home to attack EWA. But what does it say for your generation when this old geezer is coming out of retirement and destroying you all left and right? I think it speaks volumes for the for my generation, this generation. There is still quite the gap. You need to catch up. And at EWA Elite Tournament, I am going to catch you up. I'm going to bring you up to speed and I'm going to tear you down. You see, same vengeance. Actions speak louder than words, but psh, you haven't said a damn thing about our match coming up this weekend. Well, let me tell you something, pal. This could possibly be your biggest match that you've ever had. See, I face all the greatest wrestlers in backyard wrestling. I've taken on a lot of people from Jersey. I've been on the biggest shows that backyard wrestling's ever held. But what have you been on? Just really crappy EWA shows. He was on WrestleFest. Was he? Yeah. Oh. But that was Jay's show. I mean, B-Cube's show. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. But anyway, all right, fine. One show against my countless shows I've been at? Hell, man, I was one of the original members of ESW Northeast. I mean, come on. Champion. Yeah. All right, all right. Quit gloating. All right, but let me tell you something, pal. I am the first ever New Era Champion. And hell, that was after I went on like a six months hiatus, you know, with a broken wrist and everything else. And you know what? I tore up New Era. And just like when I went to New Jersey for my first time ever, psh, I tore up that match. That six man. Disqualifications are crap. You know disqualifications are the victory as much as I do. Okay, disqualifications don't mean anything. You may have a W in the rule book, but disqualifications, they're crap. That's crap. It's crap. That's crap. Continue. Pretty much. It's crap. <laughs> But let me tell you something, St. Vengeance, 
you're going to have to work extra hard. Because, buddy, I'm going to take you right straight to school. And there's nothing you're going to do about it. And once I beat you, and beat this person, whoever I'm going to face in the second round, and then go on to the finals, where it's going to definitely be a new era final, I will have no problem being the first ever two-time new era champion. We'll see. I want to be the third okay. new era champion. Okay, we'll, we'll compromise. We'll, we'll, do, we'll play beer pong for it. I mean, we could wrestle for it. Can we just play beer pong? Let's talk about that later. Okay. Right now, I want to talk about Andrew Wright and his army. Andrew Wright, yes, I'm aware you do have an army, but I mean... It, all your army is going to lead you to is the emergency room with another broken shoulder. Because <laughs> listen, pal, your army, it, does, it doesn't hold a candle to my army. My army has Alex Cross. He, his accolades include such things as a member of the Hated. He wrestled Minerva. He got shoot vertebrated and cried about it. And he got lost ten times in Rhode Island. I got J2 Step. He's very soft-spoken. He has a Bioshock tattoo. And he wears shiny yellow shorts. I got Robbie Roberts. He's emo, goes to anime conventions, and he has a gay haircut. Um, and then there's me. I'm fat. But, like... We're we're also really good at wrestling. Oh, yeah, yeah, I think yeah, I think I think we are. Yeah. So listen, Andrew Wright, you your army started a great thing, but it's time for my army to finish it. So just take a step back at Elite, okay? You can be as mad as you want that that the guy you hate, me, is coming to Elite, the show you want to destroy, and the Fed you want to destroy. But listen, I'm gonna be the one to destroy it. You know this is true. Search your heart, search your heart, search your feelings. I'm taking the place out. So. So you guys just take a step back, okay? Because I'm sick of it. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna let the cat out of the bag right now. Okay, can yeah, I? Yeah, Should I? I, I? They're not gonna do anything about it anyway. But I mean, come on, it's gonna be a good surprise. Come on. But they're not gonna. I won't. I won't name names. Okay, that's fine. All right. Bell time is twelve to twelve thirty for Elite this Saturday. Listen, you guys aren't going to have a hot opener. The opening of the show, whether you like it or not, is going to be my army hitting the ring. And until we're treated with respect, the respect I feel we deserve, I will then and only then make the announcement. What is that announcement? It's this. There is one contract left. One signed contract left for the last new EWA superstar and the last member of my army there is only one there can be only one and this is the biggest name this is the biggest the the biggest draw this is absolutely huge news for my army and devastating news for EWA and there will not be a match there will not be a, a word said from anyone else other than me <laughs> At Elite. That's what's going to start it. The start is the beginning of the end. And the next step in your demise, EWA. And there's nothing you can do about it. You, mu you just, just, just give up. <laughs>